Here I have some code where I will display a long list of numbers. K is a variable, takes on the values from 7 to 1,500. Step 18 displays the numbers staying on that first line across the screen. So my numbers are displayed uh, across the screen. They get cut off on the right-hand side. So it would be nice if I could actually display those numbers right aligned in columns like so. In order to do this, I need to make some improvements to my code. First, I need to count the number of outputs. In order to do that, I need to introduce another variable, initialize that variable, and add one each time I output something to the form. Now, each time five items are output, I will move to the next line. So if count mod 5 equals 0, I'm on the 5th, the 10th, the 15th item, move down to the next line. Let's see how this works. So I get my five items per line, but nothing will line up unless I use a fixed width font. So now I will initialize the font name and font size to Courier New size 18. At least each character occupies one column with a fixed width. Things will line up. To get the numbers to line up on the right hand side, I need to introduce another variable of fixed width. So now ST is a string of exactly six characters. We will convert K into a string and store it in the variable ST. Instead of printing K, print ST, which is the string of exactly six characters. Now when we take a look, I do have my numbers lined up in columns, but they are flush on the left-hand side, but not on the right-hand side. One last change, and that is when I convert K into a string and transfer it into the variable ST, I will right set it, pushing the characters to the right side in that string of six characters. My numbers are flush on the right-hand side, lined up on the right, in columns. I can now adjust two variables in my display, the number of columns and how wide the columns are, by adjusting the width of the string. Instead of six characters, let's make it seven characters wide. Columns are a little wider apart. I can add probably one or two more columns. This number here is the number of columns. So if I change that to a seven, every seventh output, it will move to the next line. My columns are a little too wide. So again, the width of the columns are six characters wide, and there will be seven columns displayed.